Uh, the character that I would relate to the most outside of um, my uh, outside of myself. So the character that I would relate to in the show <laughs> the most would be Huey. Uh, yeah, yeah, so. uh, I think I think he's the most normal in the show. Yeah. He's a little insecure. I'm a little insecure. Um, kind of finds his way by bumping his head and you know going in and out of testing the parameters of his identity and. You know, I think we all do that to a certain extent. I think he, for that reason, he's the vehicle for the audience in a lot of ways. So uh, I, I I, think he's the safest bit as well. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you took my, I mean, that was my answer too. I, I choose Huey as well. So <laughs> for most of the same reasons, he is the most normal character. It is, and Jack plays it so well. He's like, yeah. you can see everything in his eyes and face all the time. And his reaction to everything is so, so good. So, yeah, I think be, him being sort of the eyes of the show uh, for everyone is, is, is he's such a great character. I can tell you which character is, like, fun to write for and i'll i've said it before but the the deep is the one <laughs> that that is like a a soothing sorbet in the room yeah, right. when we're writing him because like he's always up to the most absurd stuff yeah. his dialogue sure. is so fun and funny to write chase crushes it every time so everything we give him we know is just going to be like hilarious yeah. and so like the character that makes us laugh the most in the room and have like oh we're having a fun time <laughs> is is when we are breaking the deep story i love writing for all the characters but like i lay awake at night about like yeah. homelander i'm like yeah. what's he think about this moment and and all the boys and all the characters like just making them really like you know uh psychologically complicated and 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 then we get to the deep and we're like he joins a church <laughs> you just have like a blast writing the deep so I'll, I'll i'll say the deep that's great tilda came from um you know once we learned that ambrosius was going to be a, a talking character this season we wanted to go after just like the biggest, classiest, British, most Oscar winningest actress we could possibly find. And uh, when you look, there's about four or five of them in the world. And uh, and Tilda was on that list. And so we went to her. We don't know her. We didn't have a connection to her. Uh, we just went through her reps. And, and there's clearly something amazing about her because she's like talking octopus like that fucks this character <laughs> like yes please and yeah, yeah, yeah. and she was there and uh, uh so she came in for one day to record all of her lines and I, I was there and uh it just was one of the best professional days of my life watching this unbelievably talented actress say the dumbest shit <laughs> and i'm just like it's just a but it was really a tear tear in my eye uh, Will Farrell came from at, at the time I, we were talking about me uh, potentially writing a, a, a movie for him. So we had had a meeting and, and we're emailing a little bit. And then that part came out. And um, and I thought of him because it's like it's just funny to me that like at that point, Will Farrell's like, it's time for my Oscar. And then he goes for that movie. And uh, and I just emailed him and and said, would you like do this stupid part and come out to Toronto for 30 hours? And and he wanted to. And it, he was so gracious. Couldn't have been a more horrible weather day. It was like yeah. freezing rain going sideways. And we were all like, oh, my God, we're so sorry because you have to stand outside in these horrific conditions. Oh. And he was nothing but smiles and gracious and this is totally fine and like making the crew laugh and and it just always I'm always amazed at like the the biggest names are always the sweetest people. Yeah. Um and uh and he, you know, obviously he he is laugh out loud funny. And um there's one moment, one thing I will say, and this is uh, Amazon censored us, is um when uh PJ goes up to when the director <laughs> goes up to Will and is telling him that he's gonna get his Oscar, they they make eye contact and then there's a take where they just start making out. <laughs> 
And they're just like, they're just gonna make it. Yeah, no, they're just making out. And 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 they they both emailed me and they're like, please, can we use that take? And, <laughs> and I uh, they both and I, for the record, I put it into the first cut that I showed Amazon, and and they were like, but does it make sense though? <laughs> And I'm like, no, make no sense. Make no, make no sense. But but yeah, but we ended up not being able to do it. I should have done it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That footage exists. We'll put it in the blooper. Oh, room. that'd be so funny. Yeah.